This segment of Delmarva Live is brought to you by Delmarva Dental Services. You know, there are a lot of things that can make your teeth look well, bad actually. Stains, chips, gaps between your teeth, you get the idea. And if you don't like your smile because of one or more of those issues, you may want to consider a smile makeover. But before you do, you want to make sure you're using a true cosmetic dentist. So you're not sure what that means? Well, Delmarva Life, Sydney Whitfield checked in with Delmarva Dental Services to find out. Dentists are there to take care of our teeth throughout our lives, but if we're not happy with the look of our smiles, Dr. Joseph Harmon of Delmarva Dental Services says you should seek out a cosmetic dentist, which may not be the easiest to find. I, I think that most dentists will say they're cosmetic dentists, and I think most patients, unfortunately, think their dentist is a cosmetic dentist. I think they assume that, but there's a wide variation in the skill levels Dr. Harmon says there's an actual history of how cosmetic dentistry developed. Humphrey Bogart had plastic acrylic veneers as well, and that's why he you see him do this thing like this. And the reason he did that famous look is because his lip kept sticking to the acrylic. It was rough, and so he would try to get his lip off his, his veneers. But he says the 90s were when cosmetic dentistry really took off as porcelain became stronger and plastic became stronger. The development of the porcelain veneer, which de was developed by Dr. Robert Nixon in Wilmington, Delaware. And it was a, a thin porcelain shell that you could glue over the tooth in order to uh, change the color, change the shape, uh, make teeth look straighter. Before that time, if you wanted to do that, you would have to grind the tooth down and do one of these porcelain metal crowns. Dr. Harmon says when you're looking to find a cosmetic dentist, there are a few things you should look out for. They should at least do porcelain veneers, okay? They should at least do all porcelain crowns, like this is an all porcelain crown compared to a porcelain metal crown. So I think they should at least do all porcelain crowns, which is not to say that we don't do these kind of crowns too. We do all of them, but they should at least do those as well. I think they should do plastic fillings, okay, which is not to say that silver fillings are bad, but I think they should be able to do plastic fins as well. And also think they should offer at least one form of bleaching. And then there is an ultimate cosmetic dentist, one who Dr. Harmon says can do it all. I think Ultimate Cosmetic Dentist will offer three bleaching methods. One, they'll do the trays, which you can do at home. Two, they can do office whitening, and they can do it in the office. And three, I think they should offer some form of strips. The other thing I think they should do is they should offer Invisalign to straighten teeth. Because I think sometimes you will alter the teeth less if you do Invisalign versus you just go start doing crowns or veneers. He says ultimate cosmetic dentist should be able to do a gum lift too. A gum lift is when you're, you show too much of a gummy smile. Okay, in other words, you've got too much gum or you have a, what we call a high smile line. A gum lift, I think, uh, you should be able to do it with a laser. And the reason I think a laser is better and with the ultimate practice is because when you do a laser, before we had lasers, when we raised the gums, we had to wait six weeks before we could do a veneer or a crown. With a laser, you can do it right away. And Dr. Harmon says if you're at a cosmetic dentist's office and they don't take pictures, you're not in the right place. You have to be able to evaluate the smile objectively. And the only way you can do that is take pictures from different angles. But the most important and the coolest thing is you can image them with a computer and you can do a design. You can do different designs and you can show a patient what it will look like if you do this thing versus that thing versus another thing. And then the patient knows from the beginning what they're going to get. And if you're looking for an ultimate cosmetic dentist, Dr. Harmon says, look no further. I think at Delmarva Dental Services, we, we are the ultimate dental cosmetic practice. Now, if you would like to have cosmetic dentistry done, the first step is to have a smile analysis done with the experts at Delmarva Dental Services. From there, you work together with them to figure out what your treatment plan is going to be. And it's really neat how they use those, uh, those images to show you different ways that you can change your look. Yeah. So yeah. you see what you're going to get. There you I go. Like that.